K.J. George, the Karnataka minister at the center of a row over the suicide of a police officer, has resigned. This on a day when a court instructed the police to file an FIR against him. Now, all of this, of course, is in the case of a deputy SP who accused Mr. George of harassment before killing himself. The pressure on Karnataka minister K.J. George to resign was finally too much to be shrugged off. And on Monday evening, the minister in charge of Bengaluru submitted his resignation to Chief Minister Siddharamaya after a court directed an FIR be filed against him in the case of a police officer's suicide. The opposition had been calling loudly for his resignation. Now, our demand is that it should be referred to the CBI, then only we will get justice. If not previous cases, we have not got any justice. That's why we are demanding tomorrow in front of Gandhi statue. In Parliament also, we are going to sit there and we are going to raise this issue in the Parliament also. George had earlier been in trouble as Home Minister over comments on whether rape by two men could be considered gang rape and accused by opposition leaders of involvement in a lottery scam. He continued to have the backing of his Chief Minister and he spoke to the media before meeting Siddharamaya. Somebody is putting an allegation against I wanted to come clean. That's why now the court, as for the court direction is there, I am submitting. But it doesn't mean I also go for a legal remedy, that I will take my legal remedy action immediately, consulting my legal expert. KJ George is no stranger to controversy. His stints as Home Minister and as Minister in charge of Bengaluru saw him in the news many times for the wrong reasons. The opposition has been calling for him to step down. And now with an FIR being filed against him in the case of a deputy superintendent of police suicide, the pressure was too much and he submitted his resignation. With Nehal Kidwai, Maya Sharma in Bengaluru for NDTV.